okay, we're gonna work on atoms to moles or molecules to moles, whatever they give you into moles, okay? What you begin with is what they give you and the setup that we're working on is this. The given value, you must cancel with the same type of value, same value type, let's call it, and on top you have what you're searching for. That's the setup that we're going to work with. On the first example, we have atoms given to me 8.24. 8.24. Times 10 to the 21st atoms of the reading is given to me. That's given. At the bottom, I must have the same type of value. And if I'm given atoms, that's Avogadro's number 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd. 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd. That will be atoms of IR. I'm looking for moles, okay? The ratio of, of atoms to moles is 6.0 to 2, and 10 to the third to one mole of anything, one mole of iridium. When I multiply 8.24 times one divided by 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd, you should get 0 0.01364, one point three six times ten to the negative two moles of iridium. That's the first sample. Let's work on the other one. The other one says the same type of question, but it's molecules, it makes no difference. Okay. I am given four point two four. Four point two four times 10 to the 24th molecules of dihydrogen monoxide, which is water. Cancel that with the same type of um, unit, which is in this case molecule six, same number, 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd molecules of H2O. I'm going into moles, one mole standard of H2O. Multiply 4.24 times 10 to the number of molecules times one, which makes no difference in this case, divided by 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd, and you end up with 7.04 moles of H2O. If your calculations are giving you to the 40 something power, something is off and you need to check the way that you use your calculator. Every brand differs, so you need to make sure that you practice with the one that is going to work for you.